Mr. Sal Sam Bellamio, followed by Alex Zimmerman. Uh, yes, my name is Sam Bellamio. I'm here with Stand Up America. Um, I agree with him. There's so many issues that we have to address here in Seattle, and yet we continue to do more of the same. Uh, with the study that came out in the New York Times, 48% of Americans considered low income right now. It's almost becoming a majority of our citizens that have to rely on the government. And we're not talking about the government needs more money to fund and help them. We're talking about the government needs to start changing the way they operate to work on behalf. The system, if there was mold in that apartment and she had skin lesions, that should have been taken care of. I have housing authority, Seattle Housing Authority residents coming to me telling me about other things, other damages in the apartments that they live in that don't get addressed because they're low income and they don't have the resources for lawyers to sue. Look, going to Maria Cantwell is going to change something. It's on behalf of you as the uh, government, uh, the local government, to take control of Seattle Housing Authority. We have RCWs that allow for you to dissolve the Housing Authority. You, we have RCWs that allow for you to remove commissioners in there. How can we do that if you aren't investigating them? You say they're independent, but you have all this power to remove commissioners, uh, dissolve the Housing Authority itself. So you, it's upon you to go in there and change the way they're operating. You're actually, as a body, what, devoting whether, whether you want to spend $200 million or not on an arena. That's going to raise property taxes on Seattleites because we have to pay for the, the uh, taxes for the actual uh, lot that we're, they're purchasing. So we're willing to raise taxes for an arena, but we're not willing to raise taxes to help the uh, less fortunate. There's people starving right now that need help. The system itself is collapsing that takes care of them. The, the funds are drying up because we pay the uh, director of the housing authority $200,000 a year. Federally mandated, he only gets paid $155,000 a year. He's over by $45,000. That $45,000 could help relieve struggling families that need to get into this assistance. They have a waiting list that's now a lottery. Now it's not a waiting list. I, I ask you to start acting and standing up on behalf of the people that need you the most. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Zimmerman, followed by Mr. Zarbinski. Hi, my name is Alex Zimmerman. I represent Stand Up America. And Stand Up America stands for ordinary people. Guys, we have a system that is corrupt to the bones. And I once spoke with you about judicial system, what is we have right now. Judicial system is one from three systems that is supposed to be, be absolutely independent. But this not happen right now. Judicial system never report to people. I live in the city for 25 years. We have a dozen and dozen judges. No one judge report to people. It's all elected official. By definition, this is totally against Constitution. We bring system so absolutely equal to Gestapo EKGB principle. This is exactly what has happened. By definition, this is absurd. By Constitution, this is absurd. Judicial system supposed to be absolutely independent. Right now, all judicial system under King Country Council in executive control. In Seattle, same story happened too. Guys, we need to stop in this. It's nothing to do with Constitution. It's absurd. You understand what this means? It's not tyranny. It's more dangerous than German Nazi with Gestapo or Soviet Union communist with KGB. Judicial system supposed to be independent. Judge next week will be elected half dozen judge or something like this, supposed to be report to everybody. People elect these people, supposed to be report to everybody. In chief of judges, supposed to be report every quarter. No question about this. It's supposed to be doing by common sense in Constitution. We cannot ignore Constitution absurd. It's absurd. We totally ignore Constitution. All make judges different, like U.S. Supreme Court doing, you know what this means? Or when judges elected, is people supposed to be report? Like a council, like a senator, like everybody who elect. Guys, you can change this. You can make a something small rules and regulation in city. Is this will change everything? Is people supposed to be report to people? Judge is supposed to be report to people. Judge is supposed to be absolutely independent, totally independent, no control. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Zimmerman. Mr. Zarbinski, followed by Mr. Miller.